we've seen with companies like Tesla, there is a huge market for electric cars. Yeah, there sure is. And over in West Philly, college students are taking that knowledge to a whole new level. Matt Gallen here to tell us about Penn Electric Racing. You guys Hi, ready to go fast? Yeah. Yes. Hit Let's it. go fast then. Some of the <laughs> sharpest, brightest young minds in the world have hit the pedal and taken the University of Pennsylvania engineering program to new speeds. One group in particular is using electric race cars for hands-on learning and as preparation for the future. Ah. <laughs> Why don't you make this 100 nanofarads and that 10 microfarads? Did you get that? That's okay. Not many are on the level of University of Pennsylvania engineering students, and they recently blew away the competition with this. So we build world-class electric race cars. Um, what you're looking at right now is Rev3, um, which took first place at FSA Lincoln. It's the electric race car. It's the coolest thing ever. In June, the Penn Electric Racing Team beat out MIT and 30 other schools for top honors at the most prestigious student race car design event in North America. The electric car they've built, through the help of donations from sponsors, goes fast, and it's quite impressive. It has two Gs of lateral acceleration, which yeah. is twice as fast as falling that you'll be moving sideways. This car right here actually had the fastest acceleration time of any car competition, gas or electric, um, which is a first for us. Um, it did a 0 to 75 meter run in 4.02 seconds. The team consists of more than 20 members spending upwards of 20 to 30 hours per week designing, building, and tweaking their vehicle. So it took a lot of trust on their part to let me drive it. I got the need. No, I'm not doing that. On a makeshift practice track in South Philly, the crew let me open it up. And it's every bit as quick as they led me to believe. So what's next? The sky's the limit for this extraordinary group. For more info on the Penn Electric Racing Team, go to cbsphilly.com. We will have more there. And guys, a car like that, costs over $100,000 to make, so they could obviously use your help. Wow. Feeling a little Ricky Bobby there? Little Ricky Bobby, yeah, yeah right. Okay. You like that? Shake and bake. Shake yeah. and bake and I helped, of course. <laughs> yeah, no doubt about it, guys. All right, Pat, thank yeah. you. Thanks, Pat.